Do we have any Bachelor fans here? Or should I say Bachelor Nation? Well, Peter Weber's Bachelor season was one big mess. But now it's over. It turned out that in the dramatic finale, there were not one, but three women involved, including a mom. Peter ended up with Madison Pruitt. But just two days after the finale, they're already over. Is it really that surprising? Was Peter's family the reason behind their split? Stay with me to find out if Peter Weber's mom ruined his and Madison Pruitt's short and messy relationship. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to not miss out on our content and share the video with your people. That was fast. Just two days after Peter Weber and Madison Pruitt reunited at the Bachelor finale and confessed how they loved each other, they announced that they won't be moving forward with their relationship. Are you surprised, guys? To be with Madison, Peter followed his heart and ignored the harsh opinions of his family, especially of his mom Barb's. But it seems that the differences between them were too big to overcome. Did Peter make a good decision choosing Madison in the first place? Before I give you a recap of all that went down, let me tell you what Peter said about the split. He shared a long post on his Instagram, in which he first acknowledged the group of women he got to know during the season. He also thanked Madison for her patience and unconditional love. He wrote, You're the epitome of a woman who carries herself with grace, stands by what she believes in, and loves wholeheartedly. Then he said, Maddie and I have mutually decided not to pursue our relationship any further. Believe me, this was not easy for either of us to be okay with. But after a lot of honest conversations, we have agreed that this is what makes most sense for the two of us. Then Peter addressed Hannah Ann Sluice, who he gave the ring to, but later he changed his mind. He wrote, Hannah Ann, you set an example for women everywhere a couple nights ago. You are such a strong, confident woman and you deserve all the love in the world. I accept full responsibility for my mistakes in our relationship and wish you only the best. It seems that Hannah Ann has already moved on and announced that she would love to date Tyler Cameron. But let's have a review of the final drama first. It's all very messy, so if there are any mistakes, I'm sorry. Well, it seems that it all started going downhill after the fantasy suite dates. That's when the contestants basically can get frisky. At that point, Peter had three girls with him, Madison, Hannah Ann, and Victoria. But she didn't really bring anything into the drama. So Madison is a Christian, and years ago she decided to save herself for marriage. The thing is that she explained it on the show, but she hadn't let Peter know until their date. Before that, Maddie had massive doubts whether she could move forward with their relationship and say yes to the engagement if she knew that Peter was intimate with the other girls. When she finally confessed that to him, Peter admitted that he did stuff with Hannah Ann and Victoria at their dates, and that really hurt Madison. It was so bad that she decided to eliminate herself from the show. Because of that, Peter proposed to Hannah Ann, who, by the way, was adored by his family. But after a month, he broke her heart and called off the engagement because he still had feelings for Madison. To think that Hannah almost dodged a bullet when she considered not going to the proposal. After the split, the Bachelor host met up with Maddie and told her about what happened. Then she admitted that she regretted walking away and said that she'd definitely accept a second chance. And that's what happened. Did you expect their love to last after this drama? I don't know about you, but to me, Peter and Madison's split is not shocking at all. After all, they never said that they were going to date when they reunited live on stage at the Bachelor finale. They said that they were going to take it one day at a time and see how things went. Who would have thought that it would only take them two days? But things got even more heated when Peter's mom Barbara spoke up from the audience and said that she believed that the relationship wouldn't work. But the host of The Bachelor, Chris Harrison, hoped that the couple would battle through the problems with Peter's family anyway. Why did Peter's loved ones not like Madison at all, but were there for Hannah Ann? When Peter brought Hannah home, she made such an impression on his family that Barbara was literally begging her son not to let Hannah go, with tears rolling down her cheeks. With Madison, on the other hand, they were concerned with her beliefs, high standards and expectations, and the mom was scared that she was going to change her boy. Even during the live show, Barb couldn't hide her feelings towards both girls. She was cheering for Hannah Ann and rolling her eyes and shaking her head at Madison. What was the reason for that? Barbara claimed that the viewers didn't see the things that happened off screen. She claimed that when they were about to meet, 
Madison made the Weber family wait for three hours, and later she didn't even apologize. And then she said that she didn't love Peter, and she wasn't going to accept the engagement ring. Hannah Ann, on the other hand, apparently showed them nothing but love. Peter's younger brother also wasn't too happy with Maddie, and even shaded her on Instagram. In the comments, he wrote that this was reality TV, and it showed everyone what they wanted for views and drama. Apparently, Madison was far from what the TV showed. I mean, it's obvious that producers of reality shows make everything more dramatic for views. But I wonder how it really was here. What do you think? By the way, both Hannah Ann and Madison deserved better. Whose side were you on? What was Maddie's response to the whole situation? She posted her own breakup statement on Instagram and said that she was thankful for this amazing journey. She wrote, As Peter and I have decided to go our separate ways, I am confident that we will both move in the direction of our purpose. I am convinced our paths were meant to cross and we are both better because they did. Then she tagged Peter and said, You're an amazing guy and I'm thankful for you. I will always be your biggest fan. I wonder if we will get some more dirt on this in the future. Does anyone come on these reality shows to find love these days or just to get famous, get brand deals and gain Instagram followers? What would you say? Which girl did you want Peter Weber to end up with? And do you agree that Hannah Ann Sluice and Madison Pruitt deserved better? Let's talk about this in the comments and remember to subscribe to Curiosips to stay up to date with our content. And don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Until next time.